hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and in today's video i am going to be doing my hair so this is how my hair is currently looking now i just washed it i haven't like put any product on it because i am going to be braiding but i will definitely moisturize because that's like something that i've been doing consistently and yeah so this is how my hair is looking as you can see it's growing back a little bit so i'm just trying to keep my hair into protective hairstyles and also like moisturizing and oiling my scalp so far everything it's looking good like the growth even at the back i can feel like my hair is growing and i do have like some growth going on but i do want to stretch my relaxer to at least four months so today i'm going to be doing some twist on my hair and i am going to be using some brazilian wools which looks like this i have five of them they look like this the texture is kind of like hair texture in a way i've seen a lot of like hairstyles that people did with these brazilian wools and they look absolutely amazing so that's what i'm gonna be doing today and um for my twist i want them to be like shoulder length i don't want like them to be like too long so i'm gonna go ahead and start doing my hair from the back going forward but i will keep you guys updated and then i will finish the front so i am here to give you guys an update and this is how far i've gotten i'm done with the back like they are so like they are really really light like i understand now how you see like people do like those jumbo like twists they are really really light like they are very very light and they are not as tight as normal wool and i'm not doing not less because i do have a lot of growth and most of my growth is like short at the back because of the breakage so i'm not doing not less i'm doing like normal um senegalese twist so that i can actually grab like all the little pieces so i am back now with my hair almost done i'm left with one line right here in the middle uh, which I think is about five braids I'm just gonna show you guys how I've been doing my hair so first thing first I'm going to apply um, the styling dreads gel molding gel wax and it looks like this so this is kind of like an edge control helps especially now because I'm starting to have some growth and some of my strands are shorter so this helps me like grab everything so it's kind of like a nice binder and it also makes your parting look cleaner so this is how the wool looks it comes pre-separated in a way so i'm just taking like three pieces and i didn't really like measure how long i just wrapped it around my elbow and my hand and i've got the length this is the length that i'm working with so i like to take the just one of the ends and then stretch out one piece and then leave like the two behind and then take my red tail comb and just comb out everything even the other side so this is going to help stretch out the wool and that will then prevent it from unraveling when i twist and and also i don't have to bend it because this is wool so if you don't stretch it like this then you're gonna have to put like rubber bands at the end or um bend it which i don't want <laughs> i don't want to do so i figured like if i just stretch out a little bit like this much on both ends then it's easy like it's actually sealed like as you can see so they don't unravel so now that i have my uh, wool ready i'm going to take my piece of hair here and grab it in between the two braiding pieces wrap around once just once and then start braiding like so and then separate one of the strands into two like this and then braid 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 and then once these two strands meet again 
in this hand in my right hand i'm gonna start twisting so i'm not really like braiding a lot and i'm also not braiding it too tight like that and then i'm just gonna continue twisting until i get to the end so it's really really easy really really simple and it's quick like this took me yesterday i think i did this for about maybe like five six hours and in between i had to do like school runs and um cooking as well so i just twist it all the way to the end and this is how it looks so it won't unravel and then take three pieces of the wool make sure like one is longer than other and then just take my rachel comb and just comb out the ends this is how it looks and then i'm gonna go ahead and start braiding so grab my natural hair in between the braids and then twist once like this and then start braiding and then once i have my right hand here i'm gonna take i'm gonna separate it into two like so and then braid 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 once these two pieces come back to my right hand i'm gonna start twisting so as you can see i'm not separating my natural hair i'm separating only the braiding hair or the wool um so my natural hair is staying together which will help like seal the moisture in a way and i just twist until i get to the end So I'm just going to continue finishing these three that are left. So doing the same, twisting around my hair. Braid. Separate this one into two. Braid, braid. Braid, braid. And then braid. And then now start twisting. So as you can see they are not too tight and it's another thing that i've noticed with this brazilian wool is it doesn't get too tight like normal wool like it's very very light and also like weight wise it's very very light And I'm taking my ORS Rep Set Mousse. This is what I'm going to use for all my edges. So I'm just going to apply like a generous amount. And I'm going to use like a little edge brush and just like shape them. I think I did add a lot. 
but it's fine it will dry anyways And I'm also taking like a hand full of this and just like apply it on top. And then take a silk scarf and just tie everything down until it's dry like this reminds me of like afro kinky twist but cheaper like they are so pretty and very very light like i don't know how many times i'm gonna say that but they are very very light i am so in love with them i wonder if they do have other colors like i'm gonna have to like shop around and see if i can find like maybe a number four i think a number four would look so pretty but uh, this is so beautiful i love them i love the weight like the weight is actually like the best part because they're really really light and we like in spring now it's starting to get warmer so this is how long they are like i said i just like wrap them around my hand and my elbow to get the length i didn't really like measure or anything that's how I got my length. But what's nice about them is that you can determine whatever length you want. You want floor length, you want butt length, whatever length you want, you can get. And these wools are like 850. I used two and a half. So I basically got this hairstyle for less than 30 rand. So I'm definitely going to buy more of them. This is how they're looking at the back. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video and if you did enjoy it, don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to enable the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.